guys, hello my name is Marshall here, welcome to the Mad Ops of the Space, and here I am starting our playthrough with, I'm gonna say, without trainer, for me, this is literally the most impossible as you can get in this game, which basically is this, you have to make a custom faction that has minus 195 or more points in, in creation mode and win on endless difficulty is the highest one. As you can see, uh, we have that, we have Anarchist, which means like we don't have, we have less command points, uh, we have no luxury bonus, uh, less production, uh, abilities cost more, uh, yeah we have no dust production, can't be at peace, uh, less defense, less XP for everything, less defense for fleet, not happy, uh, healing, slow travels, there are slow, research, uh, no dust, spray and failure, like not, not accurate, uh, ship cost, and we have an anomaly at the beginning, and also the others in the same cost. This is literally without trainer walking through hell and fire. And of course, I double checked it that I have 97, so I better have that freaking. them as humans and I win this. Of course, uh, what we are going to do is that I will uh, throw in some uh, factions, but not random ones. Uh, we had enough of them. Definitely not Sophos, not, not Sahedrin, Sahedrin, Sunite Empire, Cravers, Horatio, I don't think Horatio were there. Kisho, they look at us, so no. Sowers were there. Oh, Amoeba. Pilgrims. And let's go with Automatos. Yep, I think uh, this will be playing on Mendes. Games be normal. Oh boy. This would be like... Wow. As I said, without Trainer, we are going to get screwed. I modified a little bit the starting map. We are probably playing in Huge Galaxy. Uh... Galaxy Ring, actually. That would be the map. I modified it a little bit. I think there will be a lot of planets. What? I don't remember exactly how I changed it. I'm a little bit... Tired. I mean, not that tired, not able to talk, but yeah, let's just get ahead in it. Early morning, a good deal of physical activity. Apologies. And yeah. And I really wonder what I will have to get first. Yeah, because fucking hell. I literally have to get to 10%, otherwise it's uh, not possible to, to get industry. I mean, whatever works, man. Okay, this is how it looks. Pretty, pretty sweet. I think, I think you 
going to do just basic of every one of those. Then we're gonna just go hard on military, like or rather. The research of the to colonize are those two systems at the start uh, and then military because we will need it. So I guess we'll start on this one. Yeah. And the turn and then Here we're definitely going to go for uh, resources first, and then just deal with everything else. And here, of course, we will be researching everything because we need it. Yeah, nothing much will be happening, so I'm gonna resume recording uh, soon, of course. Hey, there's only recording for just a moment, it's why I am. I've been going for this for quite some time. And doing turns, finally being able to achieve all of the specific objectives, not objectives, uh, resources. Uh, there's this galactic event, my faction only, that we have some kind of virus that is killing our people. Not good, not nice, but not so much that we can do. I made some new ships uh, using the technology that Got, and I think, yeah, we should be able to build them all. Anyways, we are at war with uh, these guys. I have yet to decide, you know, to start uh, going after them like hard, but we'll we'll get to that. Actually. So yeah, when we actually get to war itself. I'll be sure to yeah, resume the recording. Okay, here we have another event. This is also another from my faction. And we found an ancient ship of the Endless. And because of that we'll be getting XP on all of our ships, which is nice. And yeah, so far I'm not expanding my empire. I didn't finish my war. I want to, I want to settle all these planets. Then we can Start bowling up our control. Another interesting event for all factions. We're going for a hostile option. We have endless war, so they are going to get wrecked. Out of prehistoric dust, and we can well fuck it up. Yep, we are doing our war. So maybe I can show you some of the options. Either you can go for cluster bombs, but we are in this trade improvements, or we can go for neutralizing population. Whatever works. Here, okay, they normally you would see like the 
chance to access of landing. Speed, or rather, I don't know what's the limit for us. But I guess we'll find out sooner or later. Okay, we got hit by another event, this time on our faction, which is not nice. We can only choose either HP, damage, or movement for 20 turns. And I guess we'll go for damage. Helpful. Okay, and because I'm recording, I might as well show you uh, the other option, which is this. Hello. Wait, I didn't have any fighters. That's. So apologies for that last clip uh, saying that uh, this was the end of episode at 11 minutes. I didn't realize that it was so short. So I've decided to throw something more for this particular episode. Like for endless space and games like this, uh, my minimum is like around 20 minutes. And majority of the episodes so far were, you know, half an hour. So that's something. Okay, we had that. Here, let's take out these planets and then we can deal with other systems, I guess. Yeah, this fleet is being, well, maybe not wrecked, but they fought a lot. Technically, I'm in a cold war with these guys, but never mind that. <coughs> yeah, they are defending. This is like my main defensive fleet. Let's see. Okay. Uh, she gets more abilities. We don't need trade routes because, well, let's be real. Uh, they don't really need them. <clears throat> oh, actually, we found flight psycho Intrix or something like that. Yeah, I have a few researches to finish. I'm not gonna research Pan Galactic Society or I mean I could research this one, but I'm built it. Okay, so let me show you more of the various options. So for example, I think I showed you cluster bombs, and what does it do? Yep, they had improvements, now they don't. And this, yeah, look how much nation got destroyed. <coughs> it's not nice, but hey, what can you do? Building a new fleet uh, for you know these guys because I'm pretty sure that the war, war will come. But I would prefer to finish this one. Upgrades, because without them, 
Ah, yeah, you erupt into a rebellion. Man, there's a lot of them. Thanks to that, the system will be extremely hard to take up, I guess. Let's go for science. There's ancient ruins, ho! Oh. Guys, can <coughs> I'll go here. <coughs> defensive fleets here, uh, we're sending my fleet here, we might as well, you know, start buying stuff. Oh! I stop. It's one of my planets. Oh, they are happy. 
be. Um, yeah, because strike and whatnot. I assume that's more stuff. Actually, wait, we took those systems. Yeah, you're doing science here, good. Food here, good. What kind of stuff you had here? Industry, go for food. That's good. Darkon, is it? Yep. Food industry dust. Let's go with dust. Industry science. Okay, yeah, we don't have much of a food surplus, sadly. Yeah, that's my influence, Saka. Hi. Uh, yeah, let's, you know, go with cluster bombs. Now we don't have them. Yeah, I don't want to wage war against these guys just yet. I mean, I have quite a lot of planets. Not going to lie. Yeah, obviously we're playing on endless difficulty. There are still some stars, like this system might help them figure out. Yeah, so we still have a lot of uh, work to do, and I will try to go and, you know, uh, this, destroy all of this, not this, I mean, be the last standing empire. Um, on normal speed, I have no idea how many turns do I have, but hope it will be enough. I think at fast, to get like 150, and I hope that I'm correct with this. Oh, 
high. Yeah, you're probably going to get wrecked. Oh. That's their empire and you cannot escape. Let's not the, the dig into that too much. And I guess I will now make an invasion. What? Yeah, that's the fucking problem. And I have bombers in there. But why does it show that? Ah, weird. No, I don't want to deal with this. Not in such a way. Wait, somehow you are alive? How? I just took out your walls? No, that's Horatio. That's also Horatio. I don't know where they could have gone. Yes, I know. I think I disabled scientific inventory just in case. Yep. <clears throat> they are gone. They got cooked. Yes, I heard it. Thank you very much for watching, hope you enjoyed this uh, episode, this time for sure, and I'll see you guys next time.